Greyhound Rescue Wales is the only organisation in Wales dedicated to homing uh, retired greyhounds and former working wretches. There are thousands of greyhounds bred each year. They race until age about four, and they can live until 12 to 16 years, which means thousands retire every year. And those dogs need a home, so Greyhound Rescue Wales is there to find homes for those dogs in Wales. Greyhounds are brilliant as family pets. They're very gentle, they're very patient. Oh, they make the most wonderful pets. They are the most laid back dogs that there are. They love their walks, they love their cuddles, they love their play. For people of a certain age, like myself, they make perfect pets. And people are under the misapprehension because oh, they're racing dogs, you know, they've got to walk for miles and miles. They don't. They're good company. They walk happily alongside you on the lead. I would recommend them. When I first came to Hillcrest, the first thing that I noticed about it was that it was such a tranquil place. You know, it was quite small, um, it was very quiet, there weren't many people here and I think the dogs really benefit from that. A lot of them have come from a really racy, loud, chaotic life where they've been racing on tracks, there's been a lot of noise and they come here and it's the antithesis of that really and I think that's so, so important to them. One of our mottos is um, from kennels to cuddles. So as soon as the dogs walk through the door, they experience love. It's not just a matter of routine, you know, cleaning them and feeding them and walking them. It's the extra care that's put into all of those things. When they come in for the first time, um, I help to uh, wash them, give them a little shower, give them hands on um, and just help to settle them in. Everybody who works here loves dogs and I think it's, it gets them used to humans and it makes them suitable for rehoming. Greyhound Rescuers are trying to be a sustainable organisation. They need funding on a sustainable framework. Uh, it became clear to me that it costs more to prepare a dog for rehoming than the adoption fee. So effectively, the more dogs you rehome, the more money the charity loses. And clearly that's not a sustainable future. We need to look after these dogs. They're gentle dogs, they're lovely dogs, and they'll reward you with faithfulness and with affection too. They're well worth the effort. The organisation has grown from strength to strength. It hasn't always been a smooth journey, but the important thing is that people have stuck with it. And we've now got a bigger team of volunteers than ever before. We're holding more dogs than ever before, and I think we're in a very good place. Come on, baby, and rescue me. Cause 